so that should be good. Today we're going to do a pork and vegetable chow mein using canton noodles. So we're going to do the barbecue pork uh, canton noodles stir fry. So I have some uh, barbecue pork here. So this is uh, barbecue pork from yesterday's dinner. So here, preheat the wok at medium heat. Put about three tablespoons of cooking oil in there. I'm going to put uh, two tablespoons of chopped ginger and garlic. Give that a quick stir fry. Next, we're going to put some onions in there. I got some of these nice uh, purple onions. It gives a nice color. So you need about maybe a half cup or so. I got some celery going in there. So I'll need another half cup of celery. I'm going to turn on the heat to high. I'm going to add about a cup of uh, cup and a half of uh, barbecue pork. So you can cut it in smaller pieces if you like. I kept the pieces fairly large here. I had a half cup of green peppers. I had a half cup of red peppers. I had a half cup of uh, slivered carrots. I'm going to put uh, two tablespoons of light soy sauce. Teaspoon of sesame oil. So these are canton noodles. So these noodles are really easy to cook. You don't need to pre-boil them. So just put a package of uh, 16 ounces of canton noodles. Put it right into the wok. I'm going to put about uh, four cups of water in there. So you can see the, the noodles become soft almost instantly. So just turn the noodles over like this. Uh, one time I said all the water absorbs the noodles. So in fact it's the other way around. The noodles absorb the water. So I got that straight this time. So just wait till the water hits a full boil. So you can see right there, that's the sauce there. I'm going to hit it with a little Himalayan salt. It's a natural salt found in caves. Uh, this is one of my favorite salts, so I, I like putting it on. So I have some cornstarch solution here. I have about a tablespoon and a half in a half a cup of water. So you might not need to use the whole thing. So just put some in. Just put some in there and stir it up so you'll know how much you need. So if you don't have enough water, just add some more water. But it looks pretty good right now. Give the noodles a final stir fry. There you have it, barbecue pork chow mein, Canton style. Enjoy.